ChatGPT versus Gemini 3. Yes, you heard that right. Gemini 3 just released and it's absolutely insane. But who can make the best Zelda clone? I'm not just talking about basic movement. I challenged them to make a fully working game with things like swords, bows, and even the actual enemies from Breath of the Wild. The result? One of them made something that blew my mind and the other? Well, it built something kind of cursed. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is ask ChatGPT to come up with a prompt for me. Alright, I sent it. Let's see what it comes up with. Alright, I'm going to copy this and I'm going to open a new chat and let's send it. To be honest, I'm not super hopeful about what ChatGPT is going to come up with, but for Gemini, I have really high standards. Alright, so I have Notepad open. Let me just paste. There we go. 518 lines. Alright, I opened the file and here we are. It's not looking too good. Alright, so I'm gonna go back to it. I'm gonna ask it to fix that. Okay, this is something. I mean, it doesn't really look like Link. Like, I don't remember him having green hair. Hey, it's actually working. No way. I can look left and right with Q and E. The one thing though is the controls are messed up. Like, I'm pressing backwards right now. Oh, I think that was just because I was rotating the camera. Never mind. But this is cool. I guess I gotta collect eight orbs. This isn't really like Zelda, but it's something. All right, it says I win. Let's go. All right, let's add more stuff. Very simple prompt. I just told it to add a sword and enemies. Okay, um, there are enemies. <laughs> they don't look like Legend of Zelda enemies, but I mean, I'm, I think they work. Like, do they damage me? All right, left click or F is sword attack. Oh yeah, let's go. I think next I'm going to ask it to add a bow. All right, I have a bow. That's definitely a bow. Do I have health? Yep, I do. It still has the movement bug, but I mean, I guess I didn't ask it to fix it. Maybe I should have. All right, sword still works. Oh, shoot. It's working. It's just shooting like backwards, I guess. When I rotate myself, it still shoots it backwards. All right, I wrote a new prompt. Let's send it and see what it does. Okay, it's actually fixed. I'm actually going forward this time. I don't need to rotate my entire camera and do that. And I mean, if ChatGPT can come up with this, imagine what Gemini 3 can do, which like beat every benchmark, basically. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Like the arrows sometimes don't hit the enemies. Wait, do they actually damage me? Oh yeah, they damage me a lot. Wait, wait, what happens if I go zero HP? Oh yeah, I died. That actually works. Okay, I don't know why the arrows just stopped working like now it's just shooting right above them not gonna lie this is pretty cool i mean you could consider it like zelda just because there's a bow and a sword i guess all right so gemini is gonna be a bit different i'm going to ask gemini to come up with the prompt here in gemini.google.com but then i'm going to put the prompt into google ai studio which also uses gemini but lets me play directly here all right i told it to come up with a prompt so let's give it a try all right i'm actually really liking this prompt i was reading through it and it seems pretty decent, so I have high hopes. All right, so I told it that I don't want Gemini to only use one HTML file. So hopefully it rewrites the prompt. I really like the prompt. I hope it keeps most of it the same. And let's build. Oh my what is this um i mean it's pretty cool that it has textures and i can sprint the thing is to look around i need to like click and drag but even that's not working anymore oh i can zoom look at that that is like literally a zelda texture bro that's actually kind of cool and not gonna lie i'm just thinking about it now how did it generate this terrain like that's actually insane like is it all one mesh or like how did it do it all right this is the prompt let's send it and let's see what it comes up with i really like this loading screen it's actually really sick Oh my god, guys, this is actually insane. Look at the sword, look how it attacks. Look how fast it is. Oh, and it turns red when I damage it? Wait, oh nah, that's crazy. Holy, wait a second. This is actually so cool. And they actually made like a player model, which is absolutely insane. Like he's got arms, legs, like a head. Oh, there's a pause menu, I just realized. Wait, that's sick. Oh, it doesn't actually pause like yeah if i pause and then and i think it detected that error like and i think i can just fix it guys look at what i just found out there is a aim feature and you can shoot arrows like it actually works i'm pretty sure it's actually yeah it actually damages them as well and i know this may look goofy but imagine a year from now how good it'll be all right it's fixing some stuff i don't know exactly what it's fixing it just showed up like oh fix the issues so i just clicked it because i guess there's issues hopefully gemini fixing it didn't break anything wait a second yo it just made the game better wait but now i can't attack and i can't aim and there's no enemies so what did it do bro like the model looks way better now like that's actually insane 
Not gonna lie, I really like talking to write the prompt. It makes it a lot quicker. Um, this is an issue. Let me just auto fix. No, <laughs> let's fix again. Okay, I'm in. Wait a second, look at that. Look at that. Yo, this is sick. Is that a bokoblin? <laughs> look at the way they're walking. <laughs> and I, I can attack them now. Oh, and I can aim. Oh, shoot. Let's go. It fixed it. This is sick. It's actually... Well, it's shooting a bit to the left of where I want it to shoot. But still, dude, this is sick. The one problem is when I kill a bokoblin, like, it seems spawn one, like, right near where I killed him. Bro, I love that <laughs> walking animation. All right, sent the prompt. Let's see what it cooks out. I'm really excited to see what new enemies it adds. Oh, let's go. Yo, no way. They actually added a river. This is like, okay, I've said insane way too many times, but this is like pretty cool. <laughs> Look at the trees. They actually got like wood textures. I, I still need to make the grass even smaller because it doesn't really look like grass. And where are the enemies? Okay, it's still shooting a bit to the left of the crosshair, but that's fine. It's got some rocks that I can walk through. Oh, I can walk through the trees as well. This is some really cool terrain generation. Oh, here. Yo. Look at that new enemy. It's a choo-choo. Wait, no way. It actually bounces. Wait, that's insane. I have health bar now. Okay, it looks like the choo-choo doesn't damage me. I haven't played Zelda in a while, so I don't remember if these do damage you, but I can attack them. Yeah, not gonna lie, this is so cool. Like, look at the texture for the water. Oh, I forgot I could sprint. This is a big world as well. Like, it's kind of crazy how big it is. It's massive. <laughs> okay, I'm taking damage, but I'm not dying, I think. Or I am dying, but then I just respawn right away with no more heart okay i think next i'm going to ask it to make the trees more detailed and add way more grass and make the grass way smaller all right i'm sending it all right looks like it's done Let's see what it comes up with this is really cool this is actually insane i need to find other words than insane to use but look at the glider look at the glider no way it actually works and i think it takes up stamina as well just like in the game it can still damage the enemies i just wish they spawned a bit more this glider is so fun to use and look at the trees like that's actually kind of what i imagined like what i envisioned when i asked for it to like add leaves yeah but the river has got to be my favorite part like it just looks so nice yo i can use my bow while on the glider look at this i'm just hitting trick shots on the ai game this is actually amazing and it did what i wanted with the grass as well gemini definitely wins i know i spent more time with it but that's because like it was producing such good results